we're fortunate to have a couple of cases today. Uh, Dr. Brett Pickering is going to tell us about the cases. Brett? Great. I have a nine-year-old boy who's been complaining of a headache for intermittently for the last 12 to 18 months. Uh, he is now oh, experiencing more frequent headaches. They're now coming up to once a week, whereas before they were happening oh, once every couple months. And he occasionally uh, complains that he gets nauseous with it, but not all the time. He never vomits. He doesn't have any fever. He doesn't have any uh, particular pattern to his headaches. I have tried to ask him, you know, do they come in the mornings, do they come in the afternoons or evenings, and they could come any of the above. They come at school, and they come at home, they come in the afternoons, they come on weekends, and even on vacation times when he's not in school. He has not had any cough. He hasn't had any really associated signs or symptoms that go along um, with his headaches. Um, nothing seems to make them worse. It's not as if um, he goes out running and that makes him worse. It's not as if he's had any trauma, uh, hasn't had anything, uh, any associated sniffles, uh, coughs and colds. And he um, hasn't found anything that makes them better all the time. Sometimes uh, Tylenol helps. Sometimes Tylenol hasn't helped. Family hasn't used any other medicines to make them better. His past, his past medical history is not significant. He's never been hospitalized, no surgeries, unremarkable pregnancy, labor, and delivery. He wasn't premature. He is an only child, and he's doing well in fourth grade. He, excuse me, his family history is, is such that um, his mom had headaches as a child, but they've subsequently uh, gone away, and they went away um, quite a while ago. She can't remember exactly how long it was.